What's up everybody? Wilds here in the garage, hanging out in the boat. A little boat talk here. Uh, this is Jax, my seven month old yellow lab. His brother's in the house chewing on something, I don't know what, probably the carpet maybe, or the, or the rugs. He's already, uh, the other one's Finn. They look like twins, and boy, these boys can be a handful, but I still love them. They're so dang cute. You can't be mad at them. Right? But see? Or are you just gonna tell me off? Yeah, he just like he just likes hanging out with me. Jackson, my boy. They haven't been on the boat yet out in the water. But uh, they will this summer. Right now it's the dead of winter. And they're gonna be a lot bigger than this. They've grown so fast in seven months. They were this big at 12 weeks when I got them in June or July, July. And now they're 53 pounds. Yeah, but they're good boys. Love to get in the mischief though. If you have two of these labs, oh, I tell you what, you're gonna have a handful. If you ever do two labs, I'm sure there's people that have them, maybe three or four. But woo yeah, it's some boat time, buddy. Jaxie. But anyways, what I'm here to talk about is um, my battery setup. It's a 2006 Ranger Z20. It also worked for a Z21 and a 19. Uh, 19 is probably a little smaller back aft deck, but should be the same size in the battery compartment area at, on the Z19. So I'm just going to tell you what I did. I went with Ionic lithium batteries. I bought a 36 volt big battery all in one and a 125 amp hour with it and a two bank charger for a 36 volt and a 12 volt. So that charges a 12 volt and a 36 volt charge, um, two bank. And uh, I, I kept my wet cell uh, for the motor, hydraulics, the, the um, power poles, um, live well pumps, and also for the turret and all the other stuff for the gauges and that whatnot. But uh, the 125 amp hour ionic battery, lithium battery, for just the electronics only. So, I mean, I'd probably run that all week without even charging it. And I don't know, I haven't tested it yet. I just got those batteries this winter. Eh, I, the price was right, that's why I did it. Um, better than what I looked at uh, previously, about, about a year ago was a lot more. I got them a little bit less. I think it was 11 year, uh, 11 year warranty on them. So here's another thing. So if you're wondering, that 36 volt, that one big battery, let's per se, it goes out, I got plan B. I still have a bunch of uh, um, th uh, wet cells. So that ghost up there, I can uh, set it up for 24 volts. I can just throw two 24 series batteries back there for a while. For the meantime, if, if something were to happen to that 36 volt ionic battery, which I'm very confident that I won't have a problem with it. So I'm ready for that. Um, so I'll just show you what it looks like in the back of this boat here and how I set it up. It was a tight fit, got it to work, or fit in this little tiny little hole back here. And as you can see, there it is. Look how tight that is. I wish I had a little more light. Look, ah, if I can get down there, it's pretty tight. And then I have the 125 over there. Uh, the, the holder down below the battery, is just a piece of plastic for like the wet cells. It doesn't fit very well, so I went and ordered that from BFE, the aluminum tray. I'm gonna put a mat on that so it, you know, when the battery's not rubbing on the aluminum. Aluminum. So it comes with the strap and all the screws and stuff. Here's where the charger is. As you can see, I had to do a little modification in there to fit it. It was really tight for some reason, but it worked. That's the two bank, as you can see there. First bank, 12 volt, 10 amp. Second bank, 36 volt, 10 amp. That's only for the 36. Set up. And as you can see there, wet cell with all the turn off switches. And that is my setup. Ionic. Um, one thing I like about these batteries as a battery management system, and I'm still pretty new to this. I can see the charge on it. So, There you have it, right there. Real tight, real tight fit. But, it, you know, I lighten it up quite a bit. 
because I had three wet cells on the side. That's, that's a lot of weight there. So I reduced the weight there. I don't know how much, maybe 200 pounds. That battery probably weighs, what, 78, 77 pounds. These batteries are about, what, almost under 30 pounds, roughly, give or take. I probably got about, mm, I don't know, we'll just say 80 with those two batteries there. And this battery right here that chews on things is 52 pounds. But there you have it. Thanks for watching. Peace. Jax, say bye. Bye.